Hello everyone, this is KJ. Welcome back to Planet Crafter. Uh, today I'm, I've been launching uh, some insect rockets and uh, we're gonna put in some flowers today. Uh, insects are up to 441,000 grams per second. It's flying, but I'm gonna do it anyway. I tried to fix the launch platform and it didn't go well. <laughs> So I ended up putting the teleporter on the actual launch platform uh, because uh, I can't get those things to line up at all. And I think what I need to do is bring this uh, thing in a little bit further. But as you can see, I changed the lines. We got lots of these things going on. <laughs> you can still do it. <laughs> derp, 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 derp. <laughs> uh, derp. <laughs> Pretty sure the storm started before the rocket launch. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> Those look cool in this light, though. Uh, but yeah, I just, I put these lights on, uh, just white, uh, no need to do anything special there. I did leave these guideposts in, but there's a light here. The thing is, these lights are too tall to actually be underneath this stuff. <laughs> so I left the guide lights and the little guide beacon lights. Okay, so we're uh, bringing in bees. Uh, just launched, I don't know, uh, seven, I think it was. Seven, eight or nine. We'll look in a second. 706. We're going to hit the uh, butterfly platform. That was my intention. Uh, let's see here. Uh, power... Satellite, uh, there we go. Uh, insect rockets, eight of them. I launched eight of them. So we're at plus 8,000%. We could have gone further with the seed spreader rockets. For that matter, all of these rockets we could have gone further with. Uh, but I was really just interested in the building aspect. It gets dark now, so we can see how bright these lights are. It's not that dark. It's not as dark as usual. Okay, so we're gonna do some flower spreading today. We might have to like, give up on carrying the food around though. Uh, that gives us room in here. I put uh, three production fuses on the bees to accomplish that, because it takes three bees per rocket. And uh, yeah, okay, so flower spreaders, we need an equal number of water, super alloy, and fertilizer, plus the flowers. Uh, I went right past the flowers. Okay, let's start with the orange ones. Uh, and then we'll have only three spaces left. So that's 15. All right, let's try that. Six. That means we need 12, uh, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I think that's right. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Oh, I don't think that's enough room for everything. No, it's not, because I can't count. All right, let's grab the water and uh, water because <laughs> it's, it's two of everything right yeah it's two of everything so we're only gonna be able to grab two of those if I do it that way um I don't know any other way I could do it let's just drop these right here in the forest that we just built provided the forest will load apparently it doesn't want to load today uh, let me see if I can get the forest to load. I did exit in the, in a storm. 
I exited to stop a storm. There we go. That got the, the trees to load. <laughs> okay, flowers everywhere. Like, just everywhere, because we have millions of flowers. Hey, there's a golden frog. Yeah, I take it back. Uh, when you uh, put down a uh, specific kind of frog, that frog appears in the environment. Uh, I was thinking that that was unrelated because of the golden butterflies. And so I think it applies to all the animals and insects. Okay, we need water. I don't know how many. I'll take that many. We have uh, hundreds of thousands of... Okay, we don't have hundreds of thousands. We have that many. <laughs> hey, there's more golden flowers at the bottom there. There we go. We have three more. Uh, and... I don't think I've gotten... I haven't gotten all of the, the chests yet. So, yeah, we don't have all of them yet. Oh, God, is that going to hit me? Probably. It'll be my second death. Oh, God, it is going to hit me. <laughs> we will go into the safety of our crash pod... Grief. Pulsar cords, you have to be so loud all the time? My goodness. You know something I notice? There's no trees or flowers inside of here. We're not even really, like, doing this with any sense. We're just dropping flowers everywhere. That was my plan. Probably we're going to have to put them, you know, somewhere else, too. Elsewhere in the world, you know. Okay, so we got lots of water left. I picked up extra super alloy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. There's a tree. There's an up thing. Hey, it was the right one. Oh, my goodness gracious. <laughs> Let's go get some more. <laughs> we might need to... I don't think I can make fertilizer here. I think I have to make it at the other place. Well, what do you know? Alright, uh, fertilizer. One, two, three. There's six of those... Uh, four, five, six of those. And three more of those. And we're definitely going to do, you know, specialty flowers first. And uh, we also, ah, oh, there it is. And we also need to do the butterfly domes. Okay. Yay. I'm actually really excited about that. I really, really pushed that the insect number up there uh, totally on purpose. And I bought uh, a ton of uh, trees. And I bought all the furniture stuff. Okay. Thirsty. I'm kind of actually thirsty. Let's see here. Oh, sorry. We have a lot to do in a really short period of time. Uh, we have a really a lot of butterflies, but uh, I thought we'd just take a quick sunshiny... Hopefully the sun's coming out. A quick little sunshiny zoom. This is pretty dark right here. I think I'd like to have a blue tree over here. I think I might do that. There is a blue tree on this side. But we might have to go get another blue tree. Excuse me. <laughs> wow, look at, oops, look at the sun hitting those trees. 
oh my gosh this is this is just all coming together there's a golden butterfly these are the trees that we planted last time uh, I think we could put a rosea in here I think it'll fit I am so pleased with this it's just it looks like my graphics aren't quite rendering that that might be the game is a little bit blurry or it might be my vision is a little blurry <laughs> okay butterflies let's do it did I miss the uh, no <laughs> it's around here somewhere there it is it's next to our pod Uh, should I put stairs up? I don't even think I can. I don't think I could put stairs there. They won't fit, you know? There's really nowhere to put them. Oh god, that uh, nitrogen capsule is still down there. Okay, butterflies. I wait forever. So this is a T2 zeolite plastic. This is T2 zeolite plastic and fabric. Uh, does anyone know where the fabric is? I don't. Wait, wait, it's here, isn't it? Okay, here we go. <laughs> I don't know how many butterflies we need, but we've got four pink ones. And another, is that a nere? Yeah, and another nere. There was an episode, a couple of episodes back, and I was watching it. I was standing over there next to food production. And uh, in the episode, At My Feet, you can actually see a Nere butterfly. And I didn't pick it up because I didn't see it when I was uh, doing the video. And of course, as soon as you log out, it's gone. You know, you just have to wait for the next one to come along. And uh, I think I have food up here. I have beans or something. There, I've got beans. Uh, there we go. That'll fill us up. Okay, let's go over to the butterflies. And, uh, oh, I didn't bring enough for more pans. I don't even know how many I have. So let's see. We can convert four. And we have four pink ones, so that's perfect. Big pans. Oh, they, see, they don't, they don't fit in the same place, you know. So we'll do that and that, and then we'll grab out that Serena, and there we go, and that and that. <laughs> this is chaos. <laughs> There's our golden butterfly. <laughs> oh my god. This is complete chaos, you guys. And that and that. And one more. And then we'll have to make uh, the butterflies after that. So, there we go. And uh, there we go. Get down there. Fit. <laughs> okay, maybe... Maybe it won't fit on that side. Uh, see, they don't fit in the same place. We'll just put it right, right there. Here we go, golden and pink. Oh my god. <laughs> well, the, the frogs and the butterflies and the chaos is just chaos. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe we should move on from here. <laughs> okay, let's go get the stuff to make more butterflies and we'll put them somewhere else, maybe. <laughs> oh my god, that was hilarious. So we're gonna have to get butterflies. And, oops, I keep doing that. Uh, we have one. We have one extra cloth here. 
Uh, oops. Uh, there's an auto crafter here somewhere. We need cloth later. Um, but we'll take that one extra there. So that's five of them. And then we need a fertilizer, zeolite, and plastic. Okay. I'm not sure where everything is, so... Uh, squash plastic. Nope, that's six. Five. One, two, three, four, five. We need, uh... We need fertilizer. Demand fertilizer. Supply... Oh, okay. Supply fertilizer. Supply fertilizer. There we go. And then make T2. Yes? Yes. And supply T2. There we go. And are we demanding T2? We are. Okay, good deal. Okay, so we can go make five pans, and we need to get butterflies for those five pans. Um, yeah. Let's go to uh, the plateau. That was a very strange teleport. We're going to put uh, 30 flowers out here, too. <laughs> okay. Totally unnecessary behavior. Uh, you know, I don't know if these algae are being collected. Um, oh, did I forget the zeolite? That's well, a good thing for teleporters. No, I didn't need to go here, but this might work. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I was thinking zeolite. Uh, plateau. So far, I haven't stressed out my actual GPU yet. I haven't checked the temperature, but uh, everything seems to be working. There we go. We'll get one of them going anyway. These these are my favorites. Now, if your butterflies are stuck like that, you just need to reload and they'll get unstuck. And uh, we can save really quickly. Exit, play, custom, and they should get unstuck. There they go. I don't know if that's fixed in 1.0 because I don't have uh, notes for 1.0 yet, uh, but I do know that it works. So let's grab our water and go to the ancient city and see if we can get some butterflies here. This will just take um, 12 seconds because we just got an Albin. <laughs> Is that what it's called, Albin? Yeah, Albin. That was good. <laughs> That's, you know, four or five games in my brain, and I just pulled that one right straight out. Oh, I don't want worms. I want bubberflies. <laughs> it's so, it's always so bright here, and honestly, I just always want to go stand in the shade. Yeah, see, I didn't need to bring any water with me. We might take a trip over to the crater as well. There's butterflies there. And as you know, there's butterflies in the mushroom cave when I can't, when I'm not looking for them. Oh, I keep forgetting I can't use that jetpack. I keep trying to use it every time I come here. It's nice and, this is my favorite color, by the way, this blue color. It's my favorite color. So we'll just hang out for a second here. I do see that blue one right there. I think, you know, I my vision for color is fine. It's just that stuff is blurry. <laughs> but I've been to the eye doctor and, and he says, nothing doing, you're fine. I didn't stuff anything in there, did I? Oh, more flowers. 
Probably we can put flower pans here. I don't know. There's a, a Furiente. Oh, I was thinking that was... <laughs> I thought that was a pink one, but those pink ones glow. The mushroom cave ones. So that's four. We just need a couple more here. I want to get back to planting flowers. Um, but we can get these four going. Maybe jump, drop by the uh, mushroom cave really quickly on our way. Oh, I forgot to check down these stairs. You got to check down these stairs because they do appear down the stairs. And the only golden butterfly I've ever found out here was actually downstairs. So you got to check that. Oh, I just want to crawl under this tree into this darkness and not be blinded by all this brightness. You can find golden butterflies out here, but they are very rare. So if you think about it in percent chances, I don't know what the exact numbers are, but I would say that by comparison to the Serena's, which we've found easily, uh, I would say the Serena's are probably in the 20 percentile range and the golden ones are somewhere around one percentile. Just by comparison, those aren't actual numbers. Those are just... Like, you know. But yeah, you gotta look down the stairs. Okay, let's take a quick stop over at the mushroom cave. Uh, mushroom cave. And we'll see if something appears as fast as it did last time. Oh, that rock color is very strange. Uh, yeah, careful you don't break your leg doing that. <laughs> There's so much stuff, you know, down here. And it's like so much stuff everywhere. And this particular save, I haven't been like uh, hugely into searching for everything. Okay, it looks like it's just going to give us some worms. I'm not here for worms. There's probably some worms underwater. I'm, I'm like, usually I drop things underwater. Oh, maybe I had room for them in the actual boxes. <laughs> I just kept putting in more boxes all right well I don't want to waste a whole bunch of time doing this because I want to do some more flowers before we go I'll just take a look back because you know how things appear behind you as you're going I don't trust it <laughs> hey where'd the cave exit go here it is Wait a minute. I missed the cave exit because I was too far up the hill. <laughs> alright. That's alright. There is a possibility, not Crater Falls. Um, did I? I did not move it. Waterfall wreck. Uh, I'm not seeing it right now. Is that where? This is not where I meant to be. I meant to be in that teleporter. The pile of uh, plankton down there is silly. <laughs> Oh, I did take the teleporter away. All right. Oh my gosh, more fishes. There's so many frogs here. Uh, there's uh, the black one, legless, appearing because we've put one in the environment. 
And now we've got the pink butterflies and yeah, that's cool. Alright. It's the same distance to the mushroom teleporter as it is to the waterfall teleporter. I was sure that I had brought a new teleporter with me, but I guess what I did... Oh, I went the wrong way. I guess what I did was move that one up there. I'll have to find some time to bring it back down. There is a butterfly over there somewhere. Uh, I don't know exactly which one it is. And now with that new entrance, it's almost just as fast uh, to go the other way. Look how immediate those things show up. Look at the butterflies flying around. That is so amazing. We need to get uh, trees and... Oh my god, look at all the booyus. We need to get trees and stuff out here. Um, trees and flowers out here as well. I might do a little bit of that off camera. Because it's a lot of back and forth if you can only carry five flowers, you know. Okay. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. We're supposed to go back to the plateau. Plateau. Put in some more butterflies. Now we'll put one of those, and we'll put one of those, and we'll put in the Albin. And we'll put in these two. There we go. We have butterflies out here now. We need some more. We'll get some more. And I'll grab the rest of the water. And we'll go home. Because we need something to eat. And we need to put all these fish away. Oh my god. Uh, everything is going in here. Frogs, butterflies, fishes. Uh, oh! Uh, all of these things. And all of those things that I forgot about. Uh, office. There we go. Uh, so we got... Uh, that smart fabric, customizable sofa, customizable bed, and the hologram projector, uh, which is a blazar and a super alloy. I think you have to put something in there as well. Let's go get a blazar. I'm going to starve to death fooling around like this. Oh my god, look at the massive butterflies. <laughs> oh, blazer, here we go. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. I need to expand this platform so we can use it for more stuff. Uh, but for just demonstration purposes, I wonder if I can put just like, can I put a tree in there? Oh, it just shows the little... <laughs> okay. Let's find, find something a little more impressive, like one of these things. Is that more impressive? Not particularly. <laughs> oh, there's some food. Uh, there we go. I actually need that. That? Uh, I don't know what would possibly be uh, better... I think that the one that they demonstrate is a rocket engine, but there's a drone. <laughs> I don't know what that's going to look like in the dark. All right, back to getting a uh, super alloy and fertilizer and stuff. That should be... Uh, oh, it turned all my fertilizer into green fertilizer. Well, that was dumb. <laughs> Let's go back to the... Good fertilizer. I think I actually need to go over here for that, though. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's hilarious. Uh, regular fertilizer. That was kind of silly of me. There's the Amido Frog. I think that that might be uh, possibly the last thing. And we'll go check. 
Oh, you're taking my fertilizer away. <laughs> and I can't make more than that. Because that's a tiny box. And there's not a lot of stuff there. Alright. Uh, qu quite the oversight there on the fertilizer. But when we come back next time, I'll have a lot more flowers uh, done. We'll take those. There's three and three. And so one, two, three, four, five, six. And is that everything? Yep. And then we just need three flowers. Uh, we'll take three of those. And we'll go back to the plateau. And uh, we'll go ahead and plant uh, some of these beautiful pink flowers for our butterflies. Here we go. These uh, Arima flowers, there's a somewhat limited number. Uh, maybe we can hide in here. It's, uh, oh, is it a big, oh boy, it's super alloy. There's a somewhat limited number of, um, of those uh, flowers, Volmus and Arima. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm gonna get a t-shirt that says meteors happen. <laughs> Me too should look into merchandise like that. It's like a t-shirt that says like Planet Crafter in the corner and meteors happen on the shirt. <laughs> oh my golly god. <laughs> like the most violent storm I think the super alloy storms sun's coming out must be almost over oh boy <laughs> And now it's going to rain, too. Wow. <laughs> Talk about piling the storms up on top of each other. And, like, in that time, our, our little field of Oremus has bloomed. That's, that's awesome. Let me just snatch those up. Oh, my goodness gracious, you guys. Rainy, uh... Our rainy uh, butterfly and Orema field out here in the plateau. Uh, are we okay? Yep. All right, you guys. Wow, that was really loud. I'm going to get some more fertilizer together. And uh, also we're going to... Oh, my Shriox trees didn't come in. Also, we're going to um, put in uh, these trees. Uh, most of them over here on the plateau. I'm going to pick up some, uh, some super alloy while I'm out here just for fun. <laughs> And uh, once again, be watching out. Coming up on April 10th, we have the uh, 1.0 update for Planet Crafter. Moose Gaming and I will both be going live. And friends, we don't know who yet. We'll have to see. And uh, I hope that we see you there. Thank you all so much for coming along. I do hope you have a lovely evening. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now. <laughs>